Italy's strikers are struggling so much they can barely find the goal in training. During one drill after another at their World Cup training ground this week, Alberto Giladino, Vincenzo Jacinta and Antonio Di Natale have been unable to find the target, even without defenders in the way. During Italy's last six games, they have scored just four goals, and only one of those was by a forward, Fabio Cagliarella in a 1-1 friendly with Switzerland. When the defending champions drew 1-1 with Paraguay in their opener, midfielder Daniele De Rossi scored the equaliser. He emphasised how humiliated the Italians would be to go out in the group stages. Losing to New Zealand would probably mean exiting this World Cup. Like what happened to France yesterday, you end up in a terrible ranking position. You can easily imagine what that could mean for us. Imagine New Zealand losing to us in the first round of a Rugby World Cup. It would be more or less as bad as that. Four years ago, when Italy won the World Cup, striker Luca Toni and defender Marco Materazzi led Italy's goalscorers with two goals apiece, while a bunch of other players added one goal each. Perhaps due to the problems in attack, as well as having nine players over the age of 30 in the squad, few pundits are backing Italy to repeat that triumph. De Rossi also said the squad would treat the entire campaign as a failure unless they reached the semi-finals.